Side and Boba Kirk going for the toss back. Needs to pop the mango for it, but that probably is going to be enough to steal the first blood. Good if they done. They more top lane as well. So Gojira is going to go down to two. Single usage of it immediately runs them away. He's like, all right, well, he's used all of his charges. He's got a little bit of cooldown. Now I can start to put him into the lane again because there's no risk. What a bit of action going on. Whisper's actually going to jump inside the cogs. And with two points in the orb, that's enough to get rid of Peachio. But meanwhile, Gojira, they will also trade the life of the He's going to be in with the combo. Toss back to Ori. Not even requiring the Thunder God's Wrath of Boboku. He's put the work in. It's only deserving that he finds the kill as well. Very important, of course, that he just continues to get that farm. His top lane is also dagger is in trouble. Be Beautiful position from Gojira to be able to run into the Dazzle. A great will buy him some time. They need to get the kill fast and look to get out because Monet is starting to stack up the damage. So Gojira wreck. Ooh! Be able to connect as well off the back of the haze. So the tiny is not going to escape. You'd love to get the kill over to the snap fire. Avalanche going to hold them back. Need a little bit more damage coming through from C Smile with the last right click. He'll get it. Oh, they find him. <laughs> it's also a lot of these key positions where they look to smoke and then move on forward. So really nice plays coming out from the supports on Asta. Yeah, I mean, the, the lane, first like... Smile. He's going to end up going down. And meanwhile, Stinger as well. Three heroes from Asta is Pichu. Why not? Top lane. A deep dive attempt onto the Dazzle, but Gojira. The hook shot's going to be on the mark to get rid of Pichio. And this is important, though. It's going to get some... Earn charges over to Whisper, but he does have the spirit. They might be able to find Gajira, able to just get that one off, tosses him into the cogs on the other side. Ooh, one more, frankly. Oh, not find him. Great cohesion. They're going to try and drop the rock for the this. Vessel. With the Mortimer Kisses this as well, five -man standing rotation. to the north side, but beautiful silence nice from silence. Whisper. Oh, that is perfect. Whisper, am I coming at cost of his own life here, Azori? It's so that he just doesn't accelerate Monet's farm even further, and now he feels confident. Now he feels like He's got a hook shot into the middle. They've got C-Smile on the higher ground as well to offer the Mortimer Kisses damage, but Boboka instantly steps in, stops that one in its track, and now Beast Coast, they're playing with a numbers disadvantage. Whisper's going to look to assassinate Pichu on the Dazzle. A little bit short on the Blink Dagger. If he had it, Whisper was also dead. They're onto they another. They're onto K1. Target. K1. This is a big kill. That's going to be the second time in the row that they should be able to kill off the Gyrocopter. Monet gets the kill. Whisper's able to at least deal with the Enigma as he tries to TP out. They're even smoking to catch up to him. For Beast Coast, it's just you need to split push the map. Okay, one who was under the wall. Poker again, man. This tiny, you, you can't give ass to the tiny. K1, he's going to try to get the call down along with I the saw. Mortimer Kisses as well. Gojira's in with a combination. It's a decent no amount damage. of damage, but where is the follow-up? No one else on Beast Coast to be seen. They don't have Whisper nearby. And Monet He's going to charge down C Smile. Forced to pop the haste to reposition. They'll turn their attention to Stinger and the tree liners again. But Boca, he started the fight. He's going to be able to end it as well, but they need to respect the turnaround. Warlock was able to drop the rock before they secured the kill. But Monet, oh, he seems unkillable at the moment. Tur TK1, I think, happening. with the ward. Mm -hmm. you know exactly the gyrocopter's positioning smoke's gonna pop. They get the Thunder gotcha. God's for the vision, and again, K1. The wards from Ash to this game has been incredible to scout out where Beast Coast are always across the map. And Monet instantly veering his attention over to the Warlock as well, making sure there is no escape. And now up the higher ground they There's go. No Boka, again, man, the vision across the map from Asta. Getting hey, a glimpse of Gojira's positioning. They get the kill, they've got the break as well, but look at Whisper jumping in the middle. The coil is going to hold back some of the numbers of Asta. K1's going to move forward as well. It's an incredible use of the rock, and the Gyrocop to finally be able to pump out the damage in the middle of the fight. They've taken multiple heroes out of the equation, but still, you haven't dealt with the raid boss on Monet. As he just charges in to the middle, Obika they've got no too. answers to the bristle back and go. Like, see Whisper. Yes, they do. It doesn't seem like they, they saw the Whisper. He is gone now. <laughs> I'll see you later, Gyro Korea, standing in the middle Radiant's of nowhere for some reason. Has been killed. <laughs>
going away at Monet. Look at how fast they're playing on Astar. They're instantly starting to move bottom. Hookshot, they're gonna try and get rid of the Dad's Orb. That's a big nuisance with the Grave and the Sustain for Popoko. Cross back to XSS. They're gonna need a way to be able to care to the ultimate, but XSS doesn't want to turn around the Black Hole. They don't even need it as Monet. Oh my god, dude. Oh, this hero is nuts. Skrindura as well, caught up from all... Nothing they could do to stop this full-on onslaught coming from Astor. It would be a miracle if they had to come back into this game. Wait. Again, the jump onto Gojira. It's always felt like Astra the ones initiating these fights. Sting is not long for this world. Why not go in, Monet? I don't blame you want to die for the chance. You might even get a couple of right clicks just get the kill onto Whisper. Well, I wish we had the player cam because the laughing coming up from Logan Bell realizing that we can feel it himself. And I want to die for the Not the great thing they need. Oh, dude. Oh, no, oh, no, no, not like See this. Yeah, All right. No. All right. <laughs> It's a good ultimate, but there's no follow-up. K1 buys back, but he's nowhere to be seen with the rock. And that will... Eh, they're gonna smoke and double back in. Why not? Radiance Nearly ages as well. Yeah, there's no coming back into this game. It honestly whispers. I mean, quick, we have a look at the mid probability as well. It was bad. Very early on. It was like eight minutes. It was already sitting at seven to eight. want to try and make this turn around. I mean, they've, they've got the five they pump stacks onto the warlock. This is what they're going for. See if they're going to have the damage before they get the kill onto Whisper, and yeah, Monet, they're able to secure with that one. They'll also get... you got to deal with this Visage if you're on Beast Coast, right? Like, he hasn't died in the laning stage. He's getting an okay amount of farm. It's what you expect going into a troll spot. See, Smile's going to move top of the Mortimer Kisses. They really want to get another kill onto Monet, and they should be able to... Or he's gonna replicate this movement. So at least get a turnaround kill. I don't he's believe they have the damage for the Earth Spirit as well. Or he's gonna soon gonna be able to block off the escape avenue. K1 still sticking nearby in the lane, but now there's the rotation. Oh, Gojira actually misses the roll, but it will not matter. They get the kill nonetheless, and K1 will claim the bounty. Much better form is coming through pretty quickly as this troll warlord does. So oh god. To be. It's gonna enter the secret shot, but Gojira with the ward on the high ground was anticipating this movement. It was in a position waiting in the tree line. Ready to pounce and the rest of Beast Coast follow up as well. Trying to do his best to block up a few camps, take away some bounty runes, invade even more onto Monet. Sees it, he's gonna have to start running away. TP's available to come through for Aston. No, but they get the silence. See if they can have the damage required though afterwards, Mane. No, just off the sticky napalm, they're gonna continue to chase him down. He'll look for a TP up the roll, comes back up shortly. But see, smile. Oh, but top lane as well. Ori. Lasso still all quit up for the moment, but whispers. He should be able to have the damage unless the coil comes out to hold him back. And now. Aster, they are parting their way top, trying to turn their attention over to killing off the Batrider and from Ori, he would... They're smoking to Monet. Double smoke from Beast Coast. The roll needs to be on point. They're going to be able to catch up where the real Phantom Lancer is. And now with the damage coming through from the Magnetize, that is huge to be able to continue to slow down Monet's farm. Everyone's coming down for the 5 on 5. It's not the easy kill. Beautiful micro from XXS. The double familiar stun into the rock fall up as well. But the sustain from the hand of God. And now the turnaround on eight. He's in trouble. A doppel able to reposition the Phantom Rush as well to get some distance. But the Scatter Blast cuts his life away. And on Beast Coast, they'll move to XXS as well. A three for one. And Beast Coast continuing to reign supreme through game two. And they're not done just yet. But with Smooth playing on the left side, unable to enter with the lasso. K1 finally. B can be activated. But once again, the Aghanim shot protecting XXS and Asta. They've done an incredible job to kite the abilities on Beast Coast. And they're going to look to turn this fight back around. Charging into the middle, they go. They'll finally deal with Makoko. The rock drop to the northern side, but K1 is in. The instead leashing them together in the middle of the fight. They're going to turn to Monate next as well as Whisper locks onto his target. And there'll be no escape from the Phantom Lancer. So finally, Beast Coast will be able to deal with Monate. Be very happy with this experience. You'll fight that. They're going to fight so much easier for you. They're going to fight back on the PL. 
I need to get something out of this. Was four fireworks on Astor. It's an incredible coil, but C Small has still got the BKB to work with. They're gonna turn to K1, but this guy with the Arcanum Scepter is not easy to kill at all. They're making quick work of it, but it will not matter. The Bork is down and out for the count, and now they'll look for Orin X, the Orchid into the roll. He's gonna buy back at least to work with K1 still charging into the middle. Again, XXS. They can't do it. The Arcanum Shard, and they're gonna be able to get him. It's such a great cost though from Asa, that's all five buybacks. Heavy, heavy investment. They have to have Sean. They have to pray that it's up. I'm here in a last zone. Oh, that what are you is doing? a dieback. Matter. There is tranquility. Oh, not like this. Jake Kajor needs to be perfect. He can always play around with the BKB. These Chris is starting to part their way to the troll. It's great to force out a battle trance as well. Coils out. There's the BKB. That is a win in itself, along with the hand of God Expender, but Whisper is looking to enter the fight from the right side. Lasso at the ready, they don't even require it to get rid of the boat god. And Whisper's gonna turn to, to leash over the Phantom Lens to drag him closer to see Small. The rock would delay the damage at the moment. But regardless, it comes out afterwards. A die back onto Mane. K1's onto his next target as well, as even Pichu will stay in his ground because they recognize this one is over and done with his Beast Coast. A much needed victory Beast taking Coast. down victory. the team at the top of the team.